Hello everyone, and welcome to this episode, of Super Brain Power. This will be a changing day in your life. And thank you for your time. And at the end of this video, you'll find a link to the next video in this series of, Super Brain Power. To start off, you'll have to get a good understanding of each element of the law of the subconscious mind, which I'll discuss in detail with you, and then how to combine these elements to manifest your dreams. Firstly we'll discuss, how the subconscious mind works. Before we can access the power of our subconscious mind and manifest the outcome we desire, we have to understand how our mind works. Your mind has two sides, the conscious or rational level, and the subconscious or irrational level. You think and reason with your conscious mind, and your subconscious mind is the seat of your emotions, and is the creative mind. What you habitually think, sinks down into your subconscious mind. If you have positive thoughts, good things will follow, if you have negative thoughts, bad things will follow. This is the way your mind works. A very important point to remember, is once your subconscious mind accepts an idea, it begins to execute it. The subconscious mind works for good, and bad ideas alike. Negative thinking will lead to failure, frustration, and unhappiness, but when your habitual thinking is positive, you'll experience perfect health, peace, joy and abundance. It is imperative, for your subconscious mind to accept whatever you desire, as true, and the law of your own subconscious mind, will manifest your desire. Whatever command you give your subconscious mind, it will reproduce the command impressed upon it. Your subconscious mind reacts, or responds to the nature of the image, or idea you hold in your conscious mind. Scientific studies performed by psychologists and psychiatrists, confirm that when thoughts or images are conveyed to your subconscious mind, it made impressions on your brain cells. At the point when your subconscious mind accepts any image or thought, it proceeds to put it into effect immediately. It uses the knowledge and experiences that you have gathered in your lifetime, to bring about its purpose. Your subconscious mind will release the infinite power and wisdom within you. Your subconscious mind accepts whatever thoughts are impressed upon. It cannot reason things out like your conscious mind, it does not know the difference between good or bad thoughts. You can think of your thoughts as seeds, and your subconscious mind as the soil. Like soil, your subconscious mind will accept seeds of any kind, good or bad. Remember, your subconscious mind does not know what is true or false, it only responds according to your habitually thinking. If you consciously assume something as true, even though it may be false, your subconscious mind will accept it as true, and manifest what you consciously assume to be true. John Kyo said. Train your conscious mind to think thoughts of success, happiness, health, prosperity, and to weed out fear and worry. Keep your conscious mind busy with the expectation of the best, and make sure. The thoughts you habitually think, are based upon what you want to see happen in your life. A good example to get a better understanding of this concept, is to look at persons in a hypnotic state. Whatever a hypnotist suggests to one of his students in the hypnotic state, the subject will believe himself to be, whatever the hypnotist tells him he is. If a hypnotist tells a subject that he is a stone statue, to another that he is a chicken, to another that his left foot is painting, and to another, that it is freezing cold. Each individual subject will respond to his particular suggestion totally oblivious to all his surroundings. This example illustrates clearly the difference, between your conscious reasoning mind, and your subconscious mind, which accepts as true, whatever your conscious mind believes to be true. That's why it is imperative, if you desire to fulfill your dreams, to fill your subconscious mind with images of your desired outcome. Your conscious mind is your objective mind. It uses your five senses to guide and direct you. Your conscious mind learns through observation, experience and education. Your subconscious mind is your subjective mind. Your subconscious mind functions at its highest level, when your five senses are in state of dormancy. Your subconscious mind is an intelligence, which makes itself manifest when your conscious mind is in a sleepy or drowsy state. Your subconscious mind recognizes your intuition, it sees, hears, smells 
tastes and feels without the use of your five senses. That's why you should always trust your feeling. How many times did you make decisions with your conscious mind, when the feeling you had, told you differently? How many times have you said to yourself, I should have listened to my feeling or little voice? Your subconscious mind can leave your body, and travel to whatever destination you desire. It has the ability to capture the thoughts of others without hearing even one word. It is so important that you understand the interaction of your conscious and subconscious mind, to fully unleash the power within you. A very important point to remember is that your subconscious mind is amenable to suggestion, meaning that it is very susceptible to what you hear, what you read, or very importantly, how you speak to yourself. As you know, your subconscious mind can't distinguish the truth from what is false, neither does it reason or conceive ideas for itself. Your subconscious mind only reacts to images received from your conscious mind. The answer to the powerful and pervasive effect your mind has in your life, lies in our response expectancies, or the ways in which we anticipate the outcome in various situations. These expectancies set us up for automatic responses, that actively influence how we get to the outcome we expect. Once we visualize how a specific outcome will occur, our subconscious mind will manifest the outcome. People worldwide use visualization techniques to overcome pain, fear, stress, depression and all other negative conditions, likewise there are people who uses visualization to achieve success, wealth and health in their lives. Thank you for watching this video, and please click the video in the end screen, to watch the next episode in the Super Brain Power series, where I'll guide you through the visualization practice. Until next time, take care.